Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if you're stuck in a check disk loop on your Windows computer. So basically, if you're running into this issue, there's a couple of different scenarios. Either the number one, you're able to actually boot into Windows, and the second option, you're not. So the first option, if you are able to boot into Windows, that's what I'm going to cover first. And then I'm going to just walk you guys through how to achieve the same result through an alternative method if you're unable to boot into Windows. So, assuming you're able to get in, we're going to start by opening up the Start menu. Just left click on the Start button one time. Type in msconfig. Best match should come back with System Configuration right above Desktop App. Just want to left click on that one time. And now you want to go ahead and left click on the Boot tab. So now you want to check mark the option that says Safe Boot underneath Boot Options and you want to set it to safe boot and the minimal. Left click on OK. It's going to say you may need to restart your computer to apply these changes. Left click on restart. Okay guys, now that we're in safe mode, I would suggest opening up the start menu. Type in CMD. Best match should come back with command prompt. You want to right click on it. And then left click on run as administrator. Now into this elevated command line window, you want to just go ahead and type in SFC. Space forward slash scan now. Scan now should all be one word. And you just want to hit enter. should begin running a system scan here and if it finds anything it should hopefully repair them and you just would restart your computer and I would suggest going back into the start menu typing in MS config here go underneath system configuration like we were before and if you go underneath the boot tab you want to uncheck the safe boot option and then left click on apply and okay so you won't end up going back into safe mode next time your computer turns back on and hopefully that should resolve the issue now if you're unable to boot into windows i was just getting the windows 10 installation media through a usb or dvd i've made several tutorials about the media creation utility so far and you guys can check that out on my channel so you basically just would insert the media once it's downloaded and you boot up the system and then once you have selected your language, you want to left click on the next prompt where it says install now in the middle. You want to left click on the bottom left corner where it says repair your computer. Should open up a troubleshoot menu, so left click on troubleshoot, and then advanced options, command prompt, and then you just would go through what I'm showing in this tutorial. So again, I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching, and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.